Hello everyone, Xenism here, and welcome back to Let's Play Blaster Master 02. Zero 03. Why do I keep saying 02? That was last LP. Which way? Okay. Okay. Last time we met. Jennifer Garner. Oof. I'm gonna have to come back. Oh! New enemy! This guy! Annoying because they just appear out of nowhere. Avoid them. And it just sends us back here. Yeah, we can't go forever. We'll traverse backwards. And just avoid them. And for here... And breakthrough. Nice. Oof, I forgot about this guy. This must be the boss we detected. 
this one might be able to move in supernatural space using ruptures just like the other boss. And you'd be careful. If it escapes into a rupture, I'll track it down with the verb system. The cosmic stampede? Mantapede! Mantapede! Is really fast and. And we really just have to just hope. He's coming that corner. And he escapes. Verse system, go. And oof. Good news is homing lasers. They help a lot. There we go. And with access key, E. This is access key to area E. You can use this to zip straight over to Stranga. Either somewhere inside the superdimensional space on Sophia. Far off getting further and further away from her from me really makes me anxious. But that sense of urgency is creeping in, but I'll be back to save you real soon. Please hang in there. Hey, Mr. Optimistic. Gotta ask you something. You're not gonna like it. What is it? Question for the boy genius who eradicates boss mutants with ease and once saved his home planet. If he truly becomes a mutant, then killing her is the only option. What's your plan, boy genius? Kill her yourself. Like that boss mutant just now. How dare you? I saved my home planet, huh? That's right. And this couldn't save his planet from the mutant invasion. He even lost the support droid. I can only imagine the pain he must feel from all that. Leave this. You're right to say I wouldn't like your question. You say all sorts of things I don't like either, by the way. But hey, I just hope you're prepared for when the time comes. What you're asking about is the absolute worst possible outcome. I'm pretty sure everything it takes to save Eve before then. Whatever you say, just suffer a bit in the end before you bite it. Come on now, let's get a move on. Hurry, <laughs> do everything it takes. Yeah. And with that, let's move. Let's continue. Okay. 
number down here. Before go in, let's try and get to that other area. Nope. But also, partly just to get that, because I knew that was going to reappear again. Okay, so I've already passed the point where I should have been grabbing it. Nope. Keep pressing A. Yeah, that's endless. Just like the seeing the image of it. Actually, does Leonis have any talk points? No. Otherwise, he would have spoke. I might have missed. Might as well just collect this. Yes, I know. I'll come back here again because apparently it's the upper path that I was meant to go into, clearly. There we go. Got new life. And that's why I want to try and get there. <laughs> because I knew that was a life. Now let's return. Continue on. Stranga.
near full health, which is fine. Now let's go! Heading in. Onward to Stranga! We arrived in Stranga. It feels like we found it somewhere new. It looks familiar but different. Ugh, just freaky as always, always. I really didn't want to come back. We keep complaining about that and we'll be here forever. Let's go find Kana and Kenwood. Let's actually see if we can talk to him about why he hates Stranga. Leave why do you hate going to Stranga so much? Didn't listen the first time? I have nothing but bad memories of Stranga. I challenged Eir to a fight once and lost. There must be music to your ears. Come on, laugh it up. I'm not gonna laugh. I'm gonna think of a kind of didn't mention something like that. Guru is a high speed area MA. And Eir is a close range specialist. Can't really see how Eir would even stand a chance. But if I ask more questions, he's definitely gonna kick my chair. I guess I'll just let it go. Now what? You got something to say, Mr. Mysterious Life Form? People have actually theorized on how uh, Lehman is lost. And it's. Yeah. It's. People have theorized that it's. Probably to do with uh, how ear fights in close proximity, in close off rooms. Meanwhile, Garuda needs close range to be able to actually do anything, which honestly makes sense. Not as satisfying as I would have wanted it to be. But hey, not everything's going to be satisfying. It's weird but the mutants are here though. But as always... We've returned. So, let's go into our first stronger dungeon. And compared to the previous game, uh, this game just makes stronger not that bad. The previous game, you guys probably saw how much I hated Stranga's dungeons. Like, they weren't badly designed, I just didn't like them. It wasn't the worst dungeon in the game, either, but still. Even this area should be a little bit familiar as one of the inner dungeons. Don't even though I don't believe it's actually this dungeon that it enters. close range. But, there's the map here. Now we can leave. And, yeah. Strang has gone bigger, in a way. But it's also gone weak, weirder. But we know which way we're going. We're going upwards. Because we can't go down. Because they took away ears 
ability from G Sophia. And now Ugh, what is that? Gross. This place is something else. It's even worse than last time. Kana, Kimwood, are you there? Hola! Your girl Kana is here! Hey Jason, long time no flower! <laughs> I still you're still in full bloom, Kana. Nice to see you as well, Yakupo. Kimwood. Pew pew! Mr. Jason, you haven't changed at all. Is what I would normally say. But you seem to have brought along a rather a rough looking companion. Oh wow, that's Toast the guy who attacked us a while ago. Found a nice plant who even extends a flower to bad boys. Here we go. A one and a two. Flower! Ugh. This guy kinda sucks. Probably should not be picky, Miss Kana. Jeez, I really don't care. Let's just get this over with. Ah, uh, yeah. I need to ask you two for a favour. Oh, come to think of it. I do not see Miss Eve with you. Something must be amiss. Please, let us hear your request right away. I see. Miss Eve is in dire straits. Oh, I was so happy when I thought she wasn't sticky wicky anymore. We need to neutralise the immune cells inside Eve to save. There might be a way on Stranga. Please, do you have any ideas? Mm. Oh yeah! I got the deet. I got all the deets. Really? You betcha. But I'll let Kenwood do all the explaining. Leave it to me, Miss Kano. Let's see now. To interest me, I believe this season's new nase herb will be most effective. N new nase herb? Where to go to Flosante? Pick that up for him. It's fresh as a daisy right now. Indeed. When you were Stranga before the herb, the herb was out of season. It was a mere sea bend. But it should be quite grown now. Grown in now. That's right. Can't apply it, it strained her head. Sure did. But now it's gone. The herb did take residency in Kana's head for some time, but it's since left for greener pastures. I didn't even notice when it left. What well, heartfelt goodbye. Do you have any idea where it went? A disturbance in space has recently appeared, and I'm afraid it may have fallen into the, that rift. That must be a dramatic rupture. You got them here too? After hearing your story, I believe it's the same phenomenon. However, this isn't the first time these ruptures have appeared here, though they are rare. Even if the mutants are causes, causing them on Sphere, ours might be different. A variety of altogether. Whoa, like, that's like a thing? I had absolutely no idea. The herbs in super too much space, I can use the verb system to track them. Kimwood, can you tell me where the rupture is? I would love to do just that, but when but this is the time of year when Strangus Crust is the most volatile. It's changing into a summer outfit. This planet is peculiar, peculiar even during the best of times. Yesterday's map is today's trash. That's the gist of it. Basically, if you knew the location we would likely get lost on the way because the planet is constantly shifting, right? If it really got into your brain, if you can follow that. So, you guys like need a helping hand? Oh, oh, or maybe like a help match? Well, now, Pierce Miss Kana is getting fired up for a change. I'm doing this for Evie Weevy. Let's find that dimension in thingy. Can you really show us the way? You have a general idea of the rupture's location. We should have no problem leading you with check ever. Thank you, Kana. Kenwood. Now get your butts in gear. My Kana senses will get us there. Ready? Kana towards now departing. First up, rupture! And we're going to ignore her. So. Oof. Uh, move. Ooh. 
right. I keep forgetting that's a poison. The good news is, those bugs we faced here last time, yeah, they're, they're not really a thing. And the game isn't as mean. I said, as mean. It's still got some mean stuff on those tricks. Get rid of these guys. Hate that enemy type. But nice of them to keep this here, even though it's not really useful. And now we can return. And now we can catch up to Kana. If we head here, we can catch up to them. And they're still as weird as ever. And I believe. No, we can't go up. Downward is only the path we got. Oh. Really? I got got. Jeez. Are those toxic forms? Probably shouldn't touch them. I believe this is a new type of plant known as Sarani. Torami? I accidentally pressed it twice. I think it says seems like a new plant has been growing here, but thankfully. Seems like every plant here has something weird about it. Hmm? Are you talking about little old me? It appears we cannot escape. I believe that the set Rani Torami works after only a few days though. You know, I always get so bummed when out when I see a plant will. That's a little secret though. A few days, we don't have that time. So Sarani was something plant. If we can deal with it, find it, and deal with it, will the forms will? That is indeed the case. You can find it before the forms. Come on, you know that'll bum me out. Too bad, Kana. We need to get going. And... We'll get to the gimmick. And since it's our first time, they make it easy. Now let's get our reward. Gravita Graviton Eraser. Deploys a black hole that draws enemies and projectiles before erasing them. You'll be seeing me use this a lot. Probably one of my favorite Jason weapons. Again? I got Ga again. Sorry. 
what is your deal? Hmm, getting a little curious about me? You know, I'm actually a mysterious and lonely planet. In my 20 years wandering this planet, Kana is the only unique life form I have ever encountered. It's me and Kana. I've searched all over to find another like her. I've never seen another species of intelligence to pile an MA. I even think I was like all alone before Ken would dug me up. It's totally bonkers. I am forever grateful that I found Kana that day. You make me blush. Great. I really didn't know any of that. I'll go ahead and look for the Sarani Torami. I have the weirdest feeling like I'm told it's gonna get trapped again. And of course, we've got nowhere to go, right? Wrong. Aqua Dash. Now. We have a puzzle. I believe that's all we need. Let's go. Two forms. Let's try out black hole. Oh, shoot! This enemy, this enemy, is annoying, but more because it can decide to appear anytime. Just keep moving. Especially since it's not affected by the black hole. I believe once it's dead, it takes a while for it to respawn again. Really? And these are here just to be blockades. Said. First time. Now with that, we're a bit more free. Like I said, a bit. Still, still can't even get a reward. Yeah, I'm just gonna dash through it. Now we broke it. Now let's get a reward. I mean, what am I doing? Just go get the reward. And we've got more health. Let's follow her. Yeah, that's just the quicker way just to deal with that. And there's two ways to go. Yeah, we want to take that path because it's kind of showing the real way. And I don't remember if this path. It's one of these paths and I don't remember which one it is. Okay, so then it must be this one. I believe we don't have to move this one. Nope, we do. I believe it's upwards. Nope. Nope. Now which path 
Okay, so let's see if it's left. If it's not left, then that means I made... Nope, I went the right path. And that's this. Do 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 do. Main SP upper. Now let's leave. Good. And we're almost done stronger. Hard to believe, huh? Okay, so there's two paths and we need to go with the upper one. Granted, I believe Kano gets stuck again. Yeah. I got God again. The prediction is totally on point. Oh, come on. You've got to be kidding me! It's becoming a common Kurtz. I'll be right back. So saw we! We're almost there! I promise! And... Yep. Now... Okay, I think that should be fine. There we go. Getting rid of that guy. Well, they just respawned. There we go. Just break through. Health. Actually, get the power up. And we need to go the other way.
With that. Black hole. Warning! Hawk Ropper! Oh no, I'm thinking of a different boss. Though that does sort of help. Next Shredder! Now I can't move. Yeah, I might. Yeah, I might just sack this run. Sorry, guys. Especially if we do that. Do that. Yeah, no. This guy. You only had two health bars. Well, rain cluster. I don't remember rain cluster being something I used because I believe it's I show. Yeah, it's a main weapon. It's maybe better against mutes. I don't think I ever used it. I should tell you how useful it is. And here it is. Here's the rupture. Made it! What, smooth and easy rise? Smooth and easy? It's definitely around here. Probably. I can smell it. But like, I don't have a nose, so who really knows? Uh, okay. Time to activate the first system and get in there. Let's activate and move. This is Stranga's super dimensional space. It's different from the reversal phenomena on Sophia. It feels like it's taking way less of a t physical toll on me. Each planet or sector must have a different superdimensional space. Wow, it feels so snuggy in here. It's so relaxing. Maybe, but it's quiet. Too quiet. Really? Because I'm hearing tons of noise. Noise? The silence is indeed suspicious. It's taking numerous life forms. But what's this? There appears to be a boss mutant lurking near the Nunase herb. There's a boss mutant here? Well, let's charge. This is the Nunase herb? It's in pretty rough shape. Oh no, this little buddy worked a bit too hard. It appears that it was it's what he spent from fending off the boss mutant. Herb took on a boss mutant? It's pretty rare nowadays. 
Sword School. That's a plan with a backbone, I must say. Yep, by this rate, it's gonna wilt. Just leave, just leave this little one to me. I'll give it some TLC. You need not say here, but it's a very, it's a very tough plan. Kind of help, I'm sure. It'll pull through. Oh yeah, I got what this plan craves. I'm counting you. That plan is our last hope. For now, I'll take care of the boss mute for you. Now, let's move. So, who's our boss? Hello again! <laughs> Rematch number three. Sarah boss? What's going on? What in the world happened to it? Hmm. If mechanical parts was able to survive in this environment. That thing must have one hell of a grudge to go that far. Respect? <sighs> God protect Khan and Kenwood. I have a peaceful life here. Time to finish you off here and now. The Plat Terminator Metal Surabos. Back for a rematch. Honestly, this fight is honestly the best skeleton boss in Sarah Boss Fox. Boss fight. But it's such a joke. Like, I'm... I'm just slamming into it. The main head is the electrical one. Is the mechanical one. But we're not done. But this time... Seems... We're going in. As Jason. And we fell down. Yeah, I'm not used to dealing with the second phase without power. Let's go. The planet terminator? Sir boss? Round two. As you can also probably know, See if that will work. I doubt it will, but hey. I'm trying to start doing damage to it.
and we can just cheat it with black hole. <sighs> okay, Kana, the boss me is down. How's the new NASA Herbert doing? She's currently showering it with nutrition. Everything should be fine. All good. Happy, happy. Is she okay, though? Kana seems to be in good spirits as well. What a relief. Now we just need to take it back to Jennifer. However, I am left wondering about the signals we picked up earlier. They seem to be connected to the boss moon, but now I'm not sure. You might be right. Something's approaching. Perhaps they were hiding from the boss moon. Oh my, you look just like... Are they the same species as Kana? That means this super dimensional space must be Kana's birthplace. I see. So it was here all along. Can we must have been searching for Kana species this whole time? <laughs> Miss Kana? She's crying? It seems I must may have misunderstood Miss Kana's true feelings. Even if she looked carefree and happy on that side, she must have felt must have still felt lonely and isolated on the inside. There is more to her than meets the eye. The same goes for all of us. Superdimensional space and Stranga were once connected through a rupture. Long ago, I see if that plant life form fell through the cracks. That was Kana. Kenwood found that seed and raised her by himself. Plant where such a mysterious plant where such a mysterious connection could happen. Stranga really is a trippy world. In the end, Kana returned from superdimensional space with us. She seemed intent to continue living in Stranga's normal space. Miss Kana, are you sure you wish to remain here? You betcha! Besides, I was like never alone after all. As long as I know that I'm... That, I'm all good. I've still got roots out here, right there. Even if they're apart, they're still connected, huh? As long as she's happy, that's all that matters, really. But you know, the same Stranga was, like, totes fluffy and good. But this Stranga has all the frills and stuff, living on the edge. I think I've still got tons of ways to grow out here. Plus, I still want to have fun with Jakapu and Kenwood. Kana, you truly have matured. Hey, aren't you forgetting something? Like your reason for coming here? Oh, yeah, of course. Kana, is the new Nasa herb ready? Flower! <laughs> I totally forgot about it. Here you go. A mysterious plant. Mysterious plant with a backbone. <laughs> Stuart Ryer. Hey, should you really be treating my thing so off? No problem. You gotta put some oomph. Into whatever you do. Thank you, Kana. Kenwood. Alright, let's get back to Nora on the double. Take care on your way back to Sophia. I hope everything turns out. Roses for Evie. See ya. Flower! And if we can warp from the retry point, it would save us a lot of time. Let's give it a shot. So, this has been bothering me since we got out of that super space. If there's noise in your voice out there. There's something busted in your bat helm. Like, what? You can fix this up for me. You m must be hearing things. <laughs> Whatever. It's your problem anyway. Next time on Blaster Master Zero Free, we're returning to Nora. Xenonizuma, signing out.